Hello everyone, today we will look at what has changed from the first released version of Windows to today's Windows. If you're ready, let's get started. Going back to 1985, Microsoft's first operating system with a graphical user interface was Windows 1.0. At that time, operating systems were only for people who wrote code, but Windows 1.0 changed things. I wasn't born back then, but thanks to my research, I have enough knowledge about the old versions of Windows. Windows 3.1 came out in 1992 and changed everything. Thanks to true type fonts, the drag and drop feature and multimedia tools, it quickly became a favorite, especially in offices. What's more, it was independent from DOS, which was a huge step forward at the time. In 1995, Windows 95 changed everything. It introduced innovations like the desktop, start menu, and taskbar, making everything more accessible and useful. And it laid the foundations for Windows XP too. Do you remember when internet browsers first came along with Windows 98? It was a different time. We all used to love the sound of a dial-up internet connection, didn't we? I wonder if any of you still have memories of that? Let's get back to our topic and take a look at that absolutely amazing splash screen of Windows. Windows XP was released on 25th October 2001 and quickly became a favorite with millions thanks to its user-friendly interface. It revolutionized the world of operating systems with new visual themes, security updates and ease of use, and we all loved it. Windows XP was so popular that it stayed on many computers for years after it was no longer supported. Some people even used it on older computers after the support ended. Do any of you remember the green icon in the start menu? Vista, such a mixed bag of emotions when it first came out back in 2007. While we all thought the visual effects were gorgeous, performance problems were annoying. Windows 7 was released on 22nd October 2009 and was such a hit that many folks were reluctant to move on to Windows 10. Some even stuck with Windows 7 for years, saying, why change something that's working well?
Windows 8 made a mark with its Metro interface design for touchscreens. And this innovation really divided users. Windows 8.1 came out on 17 October 2013 to fix all those annoying little hiccups in Windows 8 and we all said, yes that's it now, it was so lovely to see the return of the start button, it was a small but very important step, just stop for a moment and think about it, even the lack of a button shows how much we all depend on our habits. Windows 10 has become one of Microsoft's longest lasting operating systems. With its regular updates, modern user experience, and advanced security features, it has won everyone's appreciation. And now, Windows 11. It's got a brand new design, better performance, and a user-centered experience. Windows 11 is the latest version of Windows, and it's still receiving updates. It's really impressive to see how Windows has changed over the years. So, which version of Windows do you think was the best? And what would you like to see in the next video? Share this with me in the comments. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.